guys, so it's me and I am here with another unboxing video. Is everybody excited? I'm pretty excited because getting subscription boxes in the mail is kind of like your birthday or Christmas or something every day because you don't know what you're getting, you don't know when it's arriving, and it's just it's just nice and it comes in a nice package. So this is gonna be a BoxyCharm unboxing. I did get this for free, they sent it to me just to show you guys and I was just like, shoot, a makeup subscription box? Of course I'll share that with you guys because you guys know how much I love my makeup. So um, BoxyCharm is like I said, a subscription box. Unlike other subscription boxes, you do get five or sometimes more full-size products instead of like deluxe minis um, and they are value over like a hundred dollars I guess for every box and it is $21 a month for the box. I am not currently subscribed to any makeup boxes but that's just because you guys know I already have an unhealthy addiction to makeup but I think that these boxes are a great idea. I used to be subscribed to another uh, like kind of beauty related one and it was just so much fun seeing that box at my doorstep and it was also fun being able to try try a bunch of different things that I may not have known about before actually purchasing them or just learning about new products through this. So if you're into like fun surprises and just kind of trying new things, I think these are a great idea because again, they're very affordable and it's something that is just like fun to do. And also again, you get full size products with this one. So the box is very cute. This is what it looks like. Inside it comes with a bunch of like little decorative stringy mabobber thingy and then inside it says beach babe this month we are channeling our inner beach babe sexy bronze and beautiful we want you to feel the ocean breeze and soak up the sun being by the sea is a state of mind charmers and we want a state of mind charmers and we want you to make waves with this month's boxy charm box did that make sense state of mind comma charmers comma and Anyway, sorry, me and my grammatical issues. Uh, you'll be sure to turn heads with all of these summertime goodies. Kisses, your BoxyCharm team. So on the back, it says everything on the back, but I'm just gonna show you guys real quick and then I will read off the back when I do it. <gasps> Ew! Okay, so I'm immediately excited about this one because I have, like in the last few months, become obsessed with brushes. This is a full-size brush. This is by Morph. It's the S19. It looks to be... Oh, it was a little bent, but this, oh, it's so soft. That's what I look for in my brushes. Most brushes, at least I should say, because some I do want a little bit of a tougher when I'm like doing foundation, but most brushes I do look for a soft. This seems to be like a powder brush. This is the Morph Brushes Powder Brush. I was right, it's a full size. This is $19.99. Ooh, it's nice. I would use this for either laying on a light highlighter, maybe setting all my makeup with like a banana powder, or like, even, I would actually, you know what, attempt to use like a powder foundation with this, because it's just so nice and fluffy, but blending would also work too. Um, Morph powder brushes, bristles are soft and silky and great for applying the right amount of powder for a follow, flawless finish. I would say that is, that's a nice feeling brush. Um, it's not too flimsy, but it's not too like, tough either, you know what I mean, like stiff. Ooh, I like it, I like it a lot. Uh, so that is $19, so there's $20 already. You're $1 away from making your money back on the box. The next thing I'm gonna open up, just because it's so darn interesting, is this because it's in like a little bubble wrap thing. That's nice to see, because one of my subscription box back in the day when I would get them, actually came with broken products and I was pretty sad about that. So it's nice to know that they took care to wrap your products for you. Maybe a little too well. Okay, so, ooh, this is the Americana Bronzer Hypoallergenic. So it comes in a little case like this. This is the, what is this? Okay, so this is the Enter Pronoun Blowtorch Bronzer, full size. Blowtorch is a bronzer that brushes onto the skin in water-resistant powder, creating a matte, natural, sun-kissed appearance. This is $35, holy cow. Holy cow. This is $35. Like that's 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 pretty amazing that this is $35 because my Anastasia contour palette is $40. So that's awesome that you get such a nice product. I'm assuming it's really nice for that price um in your box. So already you've gone over your $21. So I'm not sure if there's supposed to be like maybe a little pat like there nothing came under here. Usually there's something that comes in here. I'm not I'm, I I don't know, maybe they they just have that there for fun, but nice mirror, nice packaging. Um, it says it goes on matte, but it's strange because it has a little shimmer to it. 
I don't know. Am I opening the wrong one? I feel like they sent me, I think they sent me the wrong bronzer. They totally sent me the wrong bronzer because this, I don't know if you can see this. Yeah, you can see the shimmers already. This is like shimmering all up around my hand. Like it looks like a disco ball in my hand. You can see the shimmers like on it. That is definitely not gonna go on matte. Not the right bronzer. So I'm a little confused. So, okay, so that's a little weird. So there's that. Um, it's a nice bronzer, although I, it's, it's a little too sparkly for me. I still like the brush, so let's just all concentrate on how pretty this brush is and what a great deal that was. Um, so the next thing you got was an Ofra eyeliner. So this is, oh sorry, this is a lip liner. This is a full size lip liner. Water resistant pencil suitable for most sensitive eye and lip areas, so you can use it as an eyeliner. Created with a synthetic beeswax base for a small soft for a smooth, soft, and long-lasting application, $13 full price. So that's nice. I always, I like brown eyeliners. Oh wait, that's not brown. So I got green. I, I don't know, would you use, why would you use a green on your mouth? Like, <laughs> um, it's very pretty. I would actually use this in my waterline because green sometimes tends to bring out your eyes if you have like dark, dark eyes. So I like this. It goes on smooth. It is not smudge resistant, however, I wonder if it's waterproof, but I mean, it went on smooth, so that's nice, so that's $13. So already we've gone over our $21. And then the next product is the Torino Tarantino Conditioning Lip Sheen. The lightweight lip sheen provides a color payoff that is buildable, leaving your lips hydrated and happy. This retails for $22 full price. So this is in the color showroom. I like the words buildable because when I think about lip stuff, I want buildable because I'm not like all for like super pigmented, um, opaque lip stuff. Holy moly, that's fancy. Can you see that? Let's talk about it. That's fancy. Like it's got like, ooh, diamonds around it. That's fancy. The packaging is like weighted too. Like it's a good metal. I mean, it's pretty, it's pretty, uh, sturdy this is the color i got like i said it's in showroom it's a pinky color goes on nice and smooth oh that's a pretty pink i don't know if you can see that underneath the green that's a pretty natural pink like it it looks like barbie pink but it comes off on my skin as like just like a nat natural like pink flush i like that i don't ever wear lipstick though like ever 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 but i would consider this just because it's so pretty oh and it doesn't smell Oh, I love that it doesn't smell. Most lipsticks smell. So that is awesome. That was, again, $22 full size. Last but not least is the Model Co. Cheek and Lips and Lip Tint in Rosies. This retails for $22 as well. Full price. Full size. And this is what it looks like. I'm actually very familiar with Model Co. Um, when I've gone to some beauty conventions, this has been in the goodie bags. And I've also seen a lot of other people unbox these things. Um, I've never used... I'm kind of scared of lip... T or not lip tints, but I'm kind of scared of cheek tints. Only because... Oh, I'll show you why. Because they look like blood. Like, I'm terrified of them just because they look so dark before you spread it out. I have this fear, like, what would that look like on my cheek? So we're gonna, oh, that's dark. That's a dark one. So let's keep rubbing. Rubbing, rubbing. See, you can see that shimmer of that bronzer still. So, I don't, uh, I don't know. It's not very blunt, I mean, huh? Kind of just blended into my skin right there, didn't it? <laughs> uh, it gives a little bit of a a rosiness to it. I don't think I would... Oh, look at my finger. Whoa. I don't think I would use it for my cheeks necessarily, but maybe I would use it as a lip tint. That's a really nice, like, deep red to maybe, like, give a nice rosiness to my lips. Ooh, and it smells really good. It smells like, um... Smells like jello. <laughs> so yeah, I would use that on my lips, not on my cheeks necessarily. So there you have it, everything was full size. I got five products all together. I got the Model Co. Cheap Tint, Lip Tint. I got the nice, pretty lip stuff. I got this wonderful brush by Morph that I really like. A green eyeliner slash lip liner, which again, I will never use as a lip liner. And then this odd bronzer, which I don't know why it wasn't the bronzer that was listed. This is the only thing that would put me off, is that the fact that like, 
I was really looking forward to a matte bronzer, but I got a shimmery one. But these products I really, really like. So four out of five, I think that's pretty good. And again, it's full size. So I'll find somebody who likes shimmery bronzers and give that to them. But I think this was a great deal for $21 to get really nice full size items. Um, this is definitely a box that I would look more into. Uh, but yeah, I don't know. I, I, I'm, I'm actually pleasantly surprised. Like this brush especially just set me over the top. I love brushes. And again, this is $20. So... You know, I mean, I really like it. So $21 for the subscription box. I will leave the link to the website below. Let me know what you guys think of BoxyCharm. I know it's a very popular makeup uh, subscription box right now. And again, I think it was a very good deal. I would definitely, like this is definitely a $20 brush. You know how some things you're like, oh, is that really $20? Like I know they say it's $20, but is it really? This is definitely a $20 brush. I can tell you right now, cause I've spent upwards to $35 for a brush. And this is like, this is a nice brush. So there you have it. There is my unboxing. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys like unboxings like this, let me know, leave a comment below or like this video. And I'll try to find some more boxes to unbox because this was a lot of fun. So, so I'll talk to you guys all in my next video. Thank you, Boxy Charm, for sending me this box. I enjoyed it, and I will talk to you all later.